Next, assign project scoring. Figure out how to score many, many decision outputs and expect that this system will make mistakes. So imagine it has made some mistakes. Which mistakes are worse than which other mistakes? And this is about lots of outcomes. You're not going to use machine learning to just make 10 decisions for you. We're talking hundreds, thousands, millions, billions, that sort of scale. So it's going to have made lots of decisions. How would you score different combinations of those outcomes? How are you going to think about this? Well, first off, how about you use a little brainstorming tool? Why don't you imagine that a hundred such decisions have been made, and there's some of every kind of good and bad outcome, and you tally up the counts out of a hundred of each possible outcome. You just make some numbers up in here that should sum to a hundred. Are you confused? If you're confused, good job, you have named this thing. Its name is a confusion matrix. And a confusion matrix simply shows you exactly that, the outcome counts, all the total number of times that each situation has happened. And you're going to use this for brainstorming. Confusion matrix, what a cool name. And then you realize it's just this? Like, seriously? Just a two-by-two two table of what happened versus what should have happened? And then you realize that this is all of machine learning. The names are just so fancy. And then you, when, when you look at what's under the hood, you're like, are you kidding me? I was intimidated for years by this. And it's also quite funny, some things have been named both by statisticians who love the thing to just be called exactly what it does on the tin, and by machine learning folk who love the, the real fanciness. And you can kind of even tell who, who did the naming just, just from the confusion matrix, neural network, artificial intelligence. Maximal margin classifier. <laughs> anyway, yeah, actually, if, if statisticians had named machine learning, we probably would just have named it thing labeling with examples. Uh, can you imagine the industry getting all excited about like, today the new hot thing in the industry is thing labeling with examples. <laughs> Let's all go to a conference on thing labeling with examples. It's sold out in 11 minutes. <laughs> Machine learning. Anyways, grumpy statistician right here. 